Yo, what's up, guys? Axley Fox Ninja here, and we are back with our video. And welcome to another episode of Undertale. I know I said no more gaming or less gaming, but eh, I couldn't really help myself. And it seems to be running smoothly. I test run it, test ran it, whatever. Yeah, and it seemed to be working well. It's um, staying at a nice 50, so that, above 50 actually, so that's, that's decent. And even when I. I even went back to the core and, like, fought, like, one enemy. Well, I spared them, of course, but, you know. So, that ran well for that, too. So, yada, 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 let's get back into this. Let me move my mouse. The elevator is in use. Oh. The elevator isn't working. That... Okay, but ooh, that's a gorgeous view. Am I on like a mountaintop or something? Or no, a, like um, an outlook, like just a really long lane kind of thing. Also, how does that work? Are there just buildings in the void? I don't know. It's kind of confusing. Here, let me move my water to something, so... Oh, here. Oh, yeah, and I also changed my webcam resolution, I was also gonna say, because I kind of like it like this, because eh, it just looks better, and just... It kind of doesn't interf interfere, interfere with dialogue much, so... It doesn't interfere with dialogue as much, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. The way is blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy. I'm in the garden. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen in the hallway. Uh, let's go to the kitchen. It's Toriel's house. It's a great reading chair, but it doesn't seem like anyone uses it. Photo albums, scrapbooks, books on how to make tea. Coals are still warm. Seems like gardening tools. And is that flowy? A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins of what we're getting right into this. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. It's a trash can. It's full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. <gasps> Wait, do I still have that? Uh, wait, sell. <gasps> yes, I do! Okay, I'm gonna take that with me just in case. Um, anything else? Uh, what do I have on me right now? Nah, well, I can look later. The stove top is very clean, so I must use fire magic instead, just like Toriel. It's a note. Howdy, help yourself to anything you want. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. The fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. Wait, what? Like escargot or something? Or whatever that thing is. Azriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. There's a heart-shaped lock inside the box. Let me take it. Got the heart-shaped locket. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Let me take it. Where You can't- okay. Okay. Um... Stuff from the Metaton fight I don't think I'll need as much. Starfay, probably not. Junk food? I don't know. Uh... Here, I'll- I'll get this and then I'll- I got the worn dagger the box is empty, okay. Um, let me see what these are. Armor Defense 15. It says, best friends forever. Perfect for cutting plants and vines. 
Alright. There are a lot of striped shirts in here. It's family photograph. Everyone is smiling. It's a drawing of a golden flower. What a comfortable bed. If you lay down here, you might not ever give it up. That's... kind of creepy in, like, a subtle way. It's a twin-size bed. Dusty toys. So, room under renovations. Oh, I see here. Over time, Azrael and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Despite everything, it's still you. Asgore's journal. J journal. All the current page. All the current page says is nice day today. I think is still almost wet. Nice day. Oh, that's that's kind of sad when I think about it because it's they're in such despair. It's a trophy. Number one nose nuzzle champs ninety eight. It's a closed door. The robes, button up shirts, and a pink hand knit sweater that says Mr. Dad Guy. It's a beret. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. It's a king size bed. Are they trying to make me feel bad for him? Yeah. It's working. You unlock the chain. Then, one day, the human became very ill. Oh no! The sick human had only one request. To see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. <sighs> the next day. The next day. Azriel, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. Is it that drawing that was back in Waterfall? Maybe. With the human soul, Azriel crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset. Back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azrael holding the human's body. Oh no. They thought that he had killed the child. attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azrael had the power to destroy them all. But Azrael did not fight back. Clutching the human, Azrael smiled. Azrael stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. 
King Asgore will let us go. King Asgore will give us all. Will give us hope. King Asgore will save us all. You should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. Just another elevator, I'm guessing it takes me back to the other area. Last corridor. I... This is all too familiar, honestly. Oh, it's Sands. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now. You will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. Ooh. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. If you kill Asgore and go home, the monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. That's a lot of pressure. <laughs> That's the garden, isn't it? The throne room. Or wait, what was the garden? Or, I don't know, but there are leaves there, so don't judge me. Ooh, I found secrets! What is this? It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Axel. It's empty. How do they know my name?! <laughs> What time are- okay. Oh, 14 minutes? Oh. That felt a lot longer. Alright. Dum -de -dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy, how can I? Oh. I 
so badly want to say, do you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do? When you are ready, come into the next room. I guess? It's a throne. It's an art throne covered by a white sheet. How tense. Just think of it's like. A visit to the dentist. Oh no. They don't really scare me. If anything, it's just annoying because I have to go somewhere, but that's all I have for commentary on that, I guess. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. Oh, are we getting into this? Oh! Is that the fourth wall? I didn't know the barrier was the fourth wall, so if we break the the barrier, we're breaking the fourth wall. Okay, okay, no, that's too confusing, though. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. Continue her back. Okay, I need to do something, BRB. Uh, wait, my items, wait! I see. Anything you want to do is important enough. Even something as small as reading a book, or taking a walk. Please take your time. What are you trying to- I did stuff! So what are you trying to tell me, game? Let me see. We got... Oh. Oh, I didn't even equip these. No, no, I want to keep that. No. Equip the dagger. Equip this. Wait. Uh, yeah. And then... Oh yeah, and then I have to go back. <sighs> And then, oh yeah, the dog residue. <laughs> I forgot about that. And then the stained apron. Nice. That's good mail stuff, so let's go back to that. Oh, that's the wrong box. Oh, nope, I want to keep that. <laughs> Dang it, stop doing this to me. Um, I have a feeling this one's going to go on a bit long. So let's be ready. Uh, what else do we have for food? Only really the snowman piece, right? Because I don't think I can eat the slippers, so... I guess the snowman piece. That's that's worse condition, okay? Because I, I want to take that to the end to see what happens. Back so soon. How do you know? Okay, if that's actually programmed into the game to actually tell how much time you take. Oh, back so soon. How are you feeling? Hmm. Well, as ready as I'll ever be, I guess. Let's go. I see. This is it then. Ready? Strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination! 
human. <laughs> human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, I can't blink for a second. Oh, 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 um. Quietly tell us what you want. I know. His hands tremble for a moment. Oh boy, how's this gonna end? Oh, okay. Tell us where you die, you don't want to fight him. He's freaking it's funny for a moment. Ah. So it's like the Toriel fight, but kind of ish. Just a worse version of that. You firmly tell Asgore to stop fighting. Recollection flashes in his eyes. Asgore's attack dropped. Asgore's defense dropped. Okay. That was easy to predict, so... Um... Seems talking won't do any more good. Uh-oh. <laughs> um, let's eat something first. Um... CT! Drink the CT, your speed boost you can recover 10 HP. Okay, these- I'm used to the game, so let's- I guess we have to. Oh, okay, I'm not used to that speed, so that's what got me. Oh, oh, I missed that one. I like the junk food. Oh, ah, oh, dang it! I thought I had, I thought I had that attack. Well, at least we're actually trying out the fighting mechanic now. I am running out of items really fast on this one. Even the text doesn't have anything to say, dang. What? Oh. Is it... Does it, like, change or something? Because I'm confused. Oh, this one. Ah. Uh. No wonder why I always go right into it! <laughs> Every single attack! And then when I go back and watch this video, I'm gonna be like, why did I do that? Axel states. Wait, is that him telling me that? Oh, that's ironic. Ironic and sad. Oh. Ready? Well, it says it. Oh, yeah, it says attack and defense drop, so I should probably do that just in case. What? He nods sadly. What was that? Oh, no. But. Okay. You don't want to fight him. No. Ah. I hate this attack. Okay, so both of those are down, so. CT or do we fight? No, I think we're good. There we go. Oh. Oh boy! Okay, phew. I didn't have to endure any more of that. Okay, at least speed is good for this. Speed is good for this. When it's like bullet hell though, that's like not. That is not good for CT. Huh, maybe I should go back to Kirsten then. I, I literally cannot dodge that one. I just can't. 
keep moving. That one, it moves too fast for me to predict it, so... Oh, okay, well... Oh, oh! Um... What do I have? Um... Lamberger. <laughs> I like the little sparkle sound. Oh, I couldn't move fast enough at all. Okay, better, better. <sighs> really getting anything on him? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. And again, I'm running out of items. Oh, that was as much as I thought it was. Okay. 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 Okay, this is intense. Bring it! Oh, the, oh, you can't pull that on me. You can't go even faster when you were, like, at really fast already. Oh, is it a homing one? Okay, is that how that works? Okay, okay, why did I go to the bottom one? Good, we're at a nice seven. Oh, oh, ah, no, no, don't take any more damage. Okay. Oh, this quiche maxed it out. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, th yeah, this moves really fast now. <laughs> okay, just stay still, basically. Because if I move, I'm just gonna hurt myself more, so... Yeah, why does this need to move faster, though? That's what I don't get. Astronaut food, I'll eat after this attack. Wait, why did that do more than my other ones? Okay, okay, good. Ah, breathe. Oh no! That score is low HP. Oh! Oh, I was. I oh oh. Well, okay, maybe I'm doing something right because I didn't fully hit him. So maybe they wanted that. Okay. Yeah, because I didn't want. I don't want to kill him. So. Ah. Uh. So that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. Aww. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just want everyone to have hope. But I cannot take this any longer. I 
just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. Oh, we got we got to. Goat Dad! I spare you! After everything I've done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface. Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like... like a family. No, 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 no,
Do not like. Do not like. Why are there tubes? Oh, shoot. Like one. Oh, great. I'm literally at like I can't tell him H HP, but I'm at one. Oh no. Oh, great! More attacks. So okay. I'm not dying though, so that's good. You called for help. Band-aids! Yay! Would it be funny if it was like freaking Tickle Me Elmo band-aids? Flowey nukes! Flowey mobs! We're gonna use all the memes for this. Flowey Guns? Okay. 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 Ah. Hello, oh, friend. Please help. I mean, I didn't die before, but I'm not gonna test that theory. Oh. What? Oh. Thumbs up. <laughs> nice. Oh boy, I didn't get half. What? Oh, okay. I see how that works. I get your mechanic. Okay, that was shorter, so that makes things a bit easier. I can't move backward. What? I can't move- I literally couldn't move backwards. Oh. And the game lagged immediately when I did that. Oh no. This is all just a bad dream. And you're never waking up. <laughs> I can just imagine like a freaking troll emoji. Oh! Oh, game crashed again! Yay. What intro are we gonna have this time? Hee hee hee. Did you really think I was gonna be satisfied killing you only one time? Oh. Okay. Okay, it's similar as attacks as before I died, so... So, did it automatically save my progress? I, and I say save, but... Um... Oh. Oh, I guess it did, because I'm on... Uh, or it's just automatically progressing, I'm guessing. Yep, there we go. I approve of that being a fellow band student. Or, I guess that's ballet, but whatever. Oh, a bit more damage. Okay. Hey, there we go. Purple. Oh, I just realized! It's all the- yeah, this is like the tour notebook thing. And there is the other one. Okay, what else is there? 
Um, we saw the ballet slippers in the tutu. You called for help. Oh, they're all like words of despair, and these are like all the good words, I guess. Okay, wow, you could be a bit more helpful than that. I just really don't want to touch those hands. Those hands are very creepy. Oh. Okay. And then there was... Uh, what else was there? Oh, there was also the... Oh, there was the knives. Like... Uh, the toy knife, I think? I don't know. Oh, and... The glove. Tough glove. Okay. Suck egg. <laughs> oh, <laughs> just a random meme I thought of, I guess. Oh. Fight, come on. Thanks for the nukes. gun one empty gun except it doesn't seem very empty right now Ooh. Hi friends Oh, thank you. <laughs> My dog started barking. Boy's defense dropped to zero. Let's kill this boy. I mean, probably not, but let's just get him to one HP then. We we're using false swipe. <laughs> Kev can't go along with it since my head my microphone keeps going off. Thumbs up. Thank you, Band-Aid. No! No! This can't be happening! You! You! Damn it. You idiot! Oh. 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 Oh.
See what good it does you. Okay. Call for help. Hey! Help me! Help me! But nobody came. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die. Oh. <laughs> Triggered much? What? How do you... Well, I'll just... Oops. What? Where are my powers? The souls? What are they doing? Oh! <laughs> Seizure warning, I guess. You're supposed to obey me! Stop! Stop it! Stop! Oh, oh. <laughs> yep, I called it. We used false swipe. <laughs> Alright. Come on, friend. Come on. Nope. I want perfect position. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. If you let me live, I'll come back. I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone. I'll kill everyone you have. Okay. <laughs> Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. Flowey ran away. Bye, Felicia. I'm so mature, guys. I know, right? Undertale. By Toby Fox. Oh, these are the actual credits. Okay. Look. Timmy Chang. Kenju. Marigo. Magnolia Park. Porter. Oh, um. Uh, Michelle Zulila. Inspired by Amoka. Uh, uh. Uh. I don't know. I can't read all these things. Mushroom Regal. <laughs> Sam Biol. <laughs> oh, I remember that part. Nice. Special thanks. Uh, I know none of these people. So that's the end. Oh, it's post credit scene. Hey, is there anyone there? Well, just call him to say, you made a snowman really happy. Woo! That's it. Game done. Game done. We did everything we set out and accomplished. I guess I should say something else, too. <laughs> oh, it's so, it's been a while. The Queen returned, and is now ruling over the underground. Oh, because Asgore died. No! Goat Dad. I mean, Goat Mom's cool, but Goat Dad! She, she's in state new policy. All the humans who follow here will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. It's probably for the best, anyway. The human souls the king gathered seem to have disappeared. So, uh, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. But even though people are heartbroken over the king, and things are looking grim for our freedom, the queen's trying her best not to let us give up hope. So, uh, hey, if we're not giving up down here, don't give up wherever you are, okay? Who knows how long it will take, but we will get out of here. Sans, who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? 
Here, knock yourself out. Wait a second, I recognize this number! Attention, human! I, the Great Papyrus, am now Captain of the Royal Guard. It's everything I've ever dreamed of, except instead of fighting, we just water flowers. Like, <laughs> like Flowey? So you're just, you just pour apple juice on him? Oh no. No, okay, no, why did I make that joke? So that's ever so slightly different. And we're helping Dr. Alfie's with her research. She's gonna find a way to get us out of here. Undyne is helping her too, though to be honest, her method of helping seems kind of explosion inducing. But I think Alfie's likes having her around. Uh oh. Hey, what are you up to, punk? Nah! Please don't nugget the phone. <laughs> hey, who's in charge here? I'm me. Oh yeah, that's right. I quit my job as leader of the Royal Guard. Actually, since we won't be fighting anymore, the Royal Guard totally disbanded. There's, uh, only one member now. But he's extremely good. Here, uh, check your face cam, okay. That's good. Enough. Yeah, he is. Come here. Please don't nuggy the skeleton. <laughs> Anyways, now I'm working as Alphys's lab assistant. We're gonna find a way out of this dump once and for all. Oh yeah, and I'm a gym teacher at the Queen's New School. Did you know I can bench press seven children? Pretty lit. Awesome, right? Hey, I'm sorry about what happened with Asgore. You were just doing what you had to. It's not your fault he... Ah, oh, darn it. I missed the big guy. Come on, Undyne, snap out of it. Uh, I guess I'll tell you how Alphys is doing. Well, she's the same as ever. Maybe a little more reclusive than normal. Seems like something's really bothering her. But she can get through it. I'm there supporting her. That's what friends are for, right? Hey, wherever you are, I hope it's better than here. It took a lot of sacrifice for you to get there. So, wherever you are, you have to try to be happy, okay? For our sakes. We'll, we'll feel better knowing our trouble was worth it. We're all with you. Everyone is. Even the queen. Hey! Wait a second. Toriel! Toriel, do you wanna... <laughs> she says she's busy. But if she knew who we were talking to... We wouldn't get the phone back for at least a few hours. <laughs> we have the mercy to spare you from her. But call back anytime, okay? She'd love to talk. Oh, whoops. This thing's almost out of batteries. So, hate to cut this short, but... Be seeing you, okay, buddy? Bye-bye for now. See ya, punk. Click. Why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends, but now you'll probably never see them again. Not to mention how much they've been set back by you. Hurts, doesn't it? If you had just gone through without caring about anyone, you wouldn't have to feel bad now. So I don't get it. If you really did everything the right way, why'd things still end up like this? Why? Is life really that unfair? Say, what if I told you, I need some way to get you a better ending? You'll have to load your save file in. Well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Al- or Dr. Alfie's? Seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows, maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. Ooh. Oh. Uh, how long have we been recording for? Well, uh, almost an hour, but we'll see. Oh, oh, right here. Okay. Well, I'll I'll probably just go back to the lab or like something. So, here, wait. I'll just jump cut to in case to like the lab unless something else happens first. Ring. <laughs> hey, uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. 
Human, you have to deliver something for me. Uh, please? I'm at stone in front of papyruses. See ya, punk. Alright. I guess we can do that before we end the episode, I guess. Tra la la, care for a ride. And the boat. Snowden. Tra la la, don't snoop behind people's houses. You might be mistaken for a trash can. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Oops. Alright. Oh, well, it's fine. Hey, there they are. Hey, I have something to give you. But you're carrying way too much. Oh, oops. Sorry, I was kind of prepared for a boss. Er, um, uh, a... Bossly interview. <laughs> well, now that I've satisfied the snowman, I think I can put that back. Oh, I need you to deliver a letter to Dr. Alfie's. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Um, well, it's kind of personal, but we're friends, so I'll tell you. Hotland sucks. I don't want. I don't want to have to go over there. I mean, to be fair, she literally did flop like a fish when she got there. So, here you go. You got the Undyne's letter. <laughs> oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm gonna freaking kill you! Uh, Undyne writes, writes a lot of letters, but... She can never seem to find the right words, so when she goes to deliver them herself, she always quits so she can go back and rewrite. That's why she asked you, because you have no standards. Wow, okay. Oh, I got confused for a second because I thought he was the one, or I was the one who had standards, because like in his fight he says, oh yeah, because he has standards, like, uh, I have zero, oh it was, I have zero redeeming qualities or I can make spaghetti. And oh no, you're meeting all my standards. It's a dog face. Cha la la, care for a ride. Uh, yeah, we'll just go back to Hotland and end the video. And we're off. Oh. <laughs> la uh oh. Suddenly, feeling tropical. Hmm. Interesting. Come again sometime. Tra la la. All right. All right. We're gonna have to save whatever comes next for the next for the next <laughs> episode. So. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please spam that thumbs up with your thumbs up and subscribe to me for some more awesome whenever it comes out content. And also hit the bell icon so you know whenever things come out and share it with your local skeleton, uh, fish lady, lizard person, goat dad, goat mom, I don't know, and whatever. And I'll see you guys later. Bye! -o!